Hello, how are we? Different angle today, so I might be a bit smaller on your screen. Um, so I've just got um, a chicken and bacon mayo from Mackey's. My daughter just went and got something for herself and she said, do you want a burger? So I just got one of them. Just reheated it a bit. Not had one before, looks pretty nice. So I thought I'd do a quick video. Cheers. Yep. I'm off today. Got to do <clears throat> more training on the computer. Got to do it today. So I'll get some energy with this <laughs> and get going. And I start my new role at work in what am I? Two weeks. So I've got a week off before I start. Can't wait. Oh, <laughs> that noise if you just heard it. For the air freshener spray things that go off every, I don't know, five minutes. My daughter got it. It smells really nice, but the noise gets on my nerves. It makes me jump out my skin. <laughs> and the cats, they do this. Mmm, I like it. So I had a right day yesterday in work. I got there. On the first floor, all the curtains were sort of hanging out the window in the dining room. I was like, my the hell's hanging out the dining room? Went into reception. No lights on, doors were wide open, and the corridor going into the ground floor was completely in darkness. Went, hello? <laughs> Anybody here? And they had a flood. Upstairs. Bird pipe under the sink. So it went all in the dining room on the first floor and it leaked down to ground. It was chaos. It's got some uh, background. Chaos. <clears throat> They managed to mop it up in the dining room. They said it was literally like walking in, paddling in the sea. So we had to get duvets from the laundry to soak the water up. So I walked into the laundry yesterday. I was in there to that. Bin bags full of wet duvet covers. And I just walked in and I went, <laughs> But they looked exhausted, the night staff, I tell ya. So half the ground floor was in pitch blackness. So they had to do the meds where the lights was. And then <clears throat> a couple of members of staff had to come in, head of our department and the cater catering. And they sorted it all out. They put lamps in the corridor where they, they could plug in the mains where it wasn't affected. But we all clubbed together and we were like, you yeah. Got the duvet done. Got them dried and it were fine, but it was, I was buggered when I got home from work yesterday. I was knackered. I worked hard. We all did.
Well, this is a story, a little story. <clears throat> There's a coffee machine in reception. And, um, you know, I think it's like the residents that are coming in with the families that, you know, want to have a look around and have a coffee and all that. So one day I saw a maintenance guy with his cup. I said, are you allowed to have a drink from there? I went, yeah. He went, not too many, like, you know. Don't use it all the time, just like once a day. I said, I never knew. I've been there near a year. And I never knew you could go and have a drink from there. And I've always liked going, oh, I'd love to have a hot chocolate. So, I kept forgetting, and then the other day I was there. And it got to about half, got quarter to four, I should finish at half four. I thought, you know, I'm going to go get myself a hot chocolate from the machine. So I got a cup from the staff room, went up, pressed hot chocolate. It started doing its stuff. And there was no milk in it. Right. Mm. I don't know. And the person that does the it's on the Sunday. The changes of the milk was wasn't him. So no one knew how to put the new milk. They need to, need to show me that. So yesterday I thought on the way to it, I thought I'll get a coffee I'll get a hot chocolate today. And everything was switched off. <laughs> so I'm not meant to have one, I don't think. Mm. Nice hat. And I've just been out and about with Georgia. And one of the residents has got these crisp. Uh, Some brings them, and I said, Oh, they look really nice. And she showed they're really nice. And she went, like, Do you want a bag? I said, Oh, no, it's fine. So I said, Well, we're going to try and, and assume one of the, like one of the residents' uh, wife, Ivy. She's so nice. Where's in the daughter? Oh, she's beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> so get these. We've not tried them. My daughter got one, so we were munching them in the car, so I've, not, I've saved mine. Um, oh, my, phone, my phone is about to die, so I better be quick with this. Yeah, it's, just, it's just like that. And it's just like uh, multi-grain snacks, and they're so nice. Mm. And we've with honey in it. And yours. Mmm. <laughs> Oh, excuse me.